bends. How it shatters into fragments, know their suspension. How they puncture the lungs and lodge, know the way the skin on your wrist separates, peels from the underlying tissue, know how the nerve endings scream, know the absent silence of water navigating your windpipe, how it tastes, how it adapts, how it burns for something that seems so innocent. Know the efficiency of the gun barrel through the thick of skull or soft underneath the mouth. Know how the gun smoke wafts away. Know that the stomach is designed to accept. Know the layer of fat that wraps around the waist. How the pierce spoon barely bleeds. How the floor can be kept clean. Know the way the noose fastens. How gravity becomes freedom. How the whiskey in your belly refuses to stay down. Know your last breath. Know the violent warning of the wind beating against your body. The intimate thousands of a second that the ground reserves to rearrange your bones. Know the abrasions on the insides of your throat. The way the pills back up like traffic. The high just before the heart convulses. Know the smooth skin of metal against your brittle palms. The easiest path for electricity through your body. What lies in its way that can hurt burn, die, know the way the flesh singes, how the scent carries, how scars can be purged, know how life slips out through every cell, every vein, every pore, how the muscles contract and lock, how the spine collapses, how blood settles, cools in room temperature like leftovers. Know the way the eyes roll back in your head for one last glimpse at God. Before dust, before ash, before bloody knuckles and a right pair of front teeth, before lies, before bandaged torso and apologies, grind your last sorries with its own tombstone, before fright, before envy, before blighted dreams and undone hopes, soak your last tears in absinthe and toast. This is why you flutter, this is why you curl, fetal kiss, love deadly, and live before ash, before dust, before all else. Know the way the eyes roll back in your head for one last glimpse at God. And consider it well.